not very strong. I was wrong. This character is actually a lot better than I gave her credit for initially. Well, I'm not gonna say initially because that's completely inaccurate. When she eventually got buffed from having her ultimate cooldown, her transformation cooldown on her ultimate going down from 3 seconds to 2 seconds, it was a pretty big buff that I... I'm not gonna say I overlooked it because I didn't, but I didn't understand the implications of it fully. And what I mean is... This allows like a whole new playstyle of her, and not even a new playstyle, it's more like you can actually use her kit properly now. So you can actually weave in between the human form and you being on a bike, and the abilities that correspond with that. So, with that being said, let's talk about Sylvia. Let's give y'all a Sylvia guide you've been wanting. Alright, so the first thing we need to know about Sylvia, and it's actually before we even get to her abilities, is her base stats are yikes. They are really bad. Like, they are not good. Sadly, that really doesn't change much. So, because this, we are going to have to play our early game pretty passive, but we're going to make up with this through the build that we got from Superstar Jenny, which is a very aggressive, tanky amp build. But our skills, they're quite good, but they're not exactly the most damaging abilities, which is why on the surface, the character can seem quite weak and not something that's like super impactful unless you really start putting some time into her. So starting off with her Q radar gun, in the human form, it is going to be a very basic skill shot. Think Senna Q. It's going to be a targeted ability, which your opponent can walk out of that will deal damage to them and heal you. You could also use this for t uh, on teammates in team modes and it'll heal them there as well. And this will also give you fuel. Fuel is the resource that you're going to be using to use your ultimate to stay on the bike even moving or to even cast abilities while, you know, on the bike. That's what fuel is. Now, as for a W, finish line. Finish line, in human form, you're going to drop a wall. Think of like a cart this wall. It's going to do a pretty big slow and it's going to uh, damage opponents who walk through it as well. In the bike form, it's actually going to be a jump. You're going to do a little front flip on the bike that actually can go over terrain. That's the only thing in her kit that go over terrain. So that's something to note. While her bike does have kind of a wonky startup and you have to wait for it to accelerate a bit, the w in bike form can go over walls and get you out in a little bit of a pinch now this is the ability that's going to make sylvia really really annoying to deal with when she's online spare tire spare tire is actually a really good ability so this is a massive ranges ability that deals more damage the farther it goes and if they are close to you will actually knock your opponent back and think very similar to the spear skill now when you use this in combination with a slow on your w with a combination with a reset on your pistol a combination of a heal you become actually really you just become a living cockroach you are just impossible to deal with and <laughs> it's not fun for your opponent i'm gonna be quite honest with you now the damage that comes out of this isn't amazing the damage that comes from a human form in general isn't amazing what we're playing around here is actually our ultimate shift gears shift gears is really strong so this is our transformability where we shape shift and you know we get on our bike and the first thing to know here is this is where the fuel resource goes into we will start consuming fuel to ride our bike and then we will consume extra fuel to use the enhance the different versions of our abilities our q w and e now things to know while on the bike is that one you can't auto attack and two when you dismount from the bike you actually get an enhanced auto attack it's nothing too crazy and you won't notice it too much but since you're going to be swapping quite a bit make sure to weave those autos in between when possible but you in general are not actually playing her like an auto attacker say electron blaster aya that is the auto attack build this is meant to be played as a caster and more of a bruiser mage is probably the best way I could describe Sylvia's current state right now. So our main like rotation that we're going to be going through with Sylvia is going to be looking something very similar to this. We are going to Q our opponent. It's very raw damage. Then we're going to drop a W and we're going to E our opponent to where it knocks them into the W. After this, we're immediately going to go into our ultimate. We are going to use our E in the ultimate form, which is going to push us towards them. Then we are going to Q, which is the AoE spin that's going to be our bread and butter and damage. And then our W, which is the knockup that deals a good amount of damage. After this, we are going to disengage from our ultimate. I know it's a lot of APM here. And then any abilities up there we are going to use get an auto attack in with the enhanced auto attack that we got from swapping back to human form 
and then reset with our pistol skill. And for those who don't know, the pistol skill is an active that gives us a burst of moon speed and reduces our cooldown by a flat amount. Now, the reason this is so good on Sylvia is because it reduces the cooldowns of your bike skills. And that's that's kind of the big thing here. So if we are able to do things properly, which is, you know, landing our Q and E, we should have enough fuel to just get back into the fight after a couple rotations and just finish off our opponent with our ultimate. So it is a very extensive character. One thing I will say right off the bat, and the main reason why I was calling this character for so bad for so long is her damage isn't something that you see right away. This is not a Jackie. This is not a character you play and you see those numbers just pop up in front of you. No, you have to really put in the effort for those kills, but she actually has a really strong kit to stay alive, to get in those fights, and has the ability to go around the map like super efficiently and just farm up a ton of mastery. This character is actually probably even better than what I currently put her on my tier list, but I think the even the best people on her right now are still learning her ever so slowly. And of course, the last thing we need to cover here is her passive, Lumia Grand Prix. So this is one of the reasons why some of her base stats are so low, namely her attack speed. Because upon entering a new area, her attack speed is increased for a short amount of time, but after she visits all 15 areas, which is every single area in the game, her skill amplification is increased by 15%. It is massive. Do not, and I cannot say this enough, do not ignore this. It is a huge amplification. It is not hard to get. You're going to visit a good chunk of the areas in the game just through farming anyways. So, you know, just have the conscious mindset to open up your map, look at the areas that aren't grayed out, and then like either bike into them or just walk into them for a few seconds and you'll see the animation pop up. Uh, the last thing you want to do is be caught in a situation where you're waiting or where it's impossible for you to actually get to the last zones you need because archery range is closed off and every zone near it is also closed off. So for you to get it, you have to tank 25 seconds and it's just not worth it at that point. Now, the last part of her passive is that Sylvia gains fuel when visiting a new area and she also regains fuel every few seconds when not on her bike. This is actually a very interesting thing because we actually don't level this. What we're leveling is going to be something kind of odd. It's not, not what you would think right off the bat. So there's a couple variations this where we have Emax into Q, into W, into ulti whenever, into passive. Or the alternative is going to be R, E, Q, W, P, or you could do R, E, W, Q, P. Like after R and E, you could do these in any order. Um, if you're not really doing good at fuel efficiency and you're having issues there, you could put more points into your passive. But if you really want to get better with this character, I do recommend actually skipping those points out and putting them into your base of beliefs instead. As again, this is a character that putting a one point into your E, for example, is going to enhance two of different abilities. So that's going to get you more damage and you desperately need that damage or you're going to be pretty sad. So now the big things I do want to know on this character is a couple simple combos. So the first one is going to be in your human form is that when you're doing a fight to guarantee the damage of your W, you can not come back into it with your E, right? Another thing with your E spare tire to gain the most amount of fuel out of it, you should know where animals are spawning. So if you know where animals are, even in the fog of war, you could throw a max range E to gain a ton of fuel and just deal a lot of damage. This is how we're going to be getting our weapon most of the game as Sylvia's early game is atrocious. Uh, once she hits level 6, she's very strong, but her early game is really, really bad. So we actually struggle quite a bit because of that. So to kill things, even say like chickens, we're going to be throwing our E from very far away. So, you know, just walk up, be able to auto attack them once and one shot them. And of course, lastly, like we mentioned earlier, on bike form, her W can go over terrain. And the pistol skill will reset the bike cooldowns as well as the human cooldowns. But do make sure before using the pistol skill, you do have enough fuel to actually go in and you're not just there on the bike looking kind of silly now as for the route so like we mentioned earlier the route that we're going to be taking and the build that we're going to be taking is a very much a bruiser amp build so this is a very very spicy build courtesy of superstar jenny absolutely amazing player this is the same person that uh, won our sub tourney last friday on sylvia with some of the incredibly sweaty players they put on one heck of a show on this character and it's honestly the reason i changed my mind i was watching I was commentating on that tournament. I was like, wow, this character is doing some amazing things. And honestly, we just need to see a better pilot. And I wasn't that person. So shout out to Superstar Jenny for just being the absolute goat of this character. Not giving up on her. But yeah, let's talk about their build. I'm bad. Hyping them up a little too much. So this is going to be an elegance route. And with elegance, the main thing of concern here is we need to kill chickens. There's going to be three chickens in the hospital that are going to spawn pretty early on. And we are going to want to try and kill them. So our main priority is whatever we spawn we're gonna try and loot towards the chickens and get a max range e off on 
one of the chickens. You're probably gonna miss it. If you're not comfortable with hitting the max range E, just try to, you know, get it to where you can see it and then toss it from as far as possible. With that, we kill up a couple auto attacks and pray for our leather. We just need one leather because otherwise the rest of the route in getting leather is a little tedious as the only real thing we can do as Sylvia is kill bats, which we can find in temple right in the middle on the side and we can find one at pond right here. If that fails, we could dip into avenue real quick and try to kill the chicken and or dog there, but killing a dog as Sylvia pre-level six is pretty bad. And since we're not gonna be able to craft elegance if we miss the leather, we probably won't be level six by that point anyways. So these are the little things to keep in mind. Now, of course, with any build, you do need to pay attention to where your everyone else on the map is spawning. This is not something as simple as just be telling like, hey, you know, there's gonna be five people pawn. Maybe you shouldn't go pawned. This is gonna be something you're gonna need to figure out, right? So things that do overlap here are things like short rod. We can find that in temple. Gemstones, we can also find this in, in temple, correct? We can also find it in forest. We can also find it in beach. So if pawn is taken, most likely you're probably gonna have to go somewhere else. And another one like temple, if temple's taken, which it most likely will be because temple is an extremely efficient starting zone right now, um, you're gonna have to go somewhere else. More than likely, you're gonna be looking for your paper. So you go to archery range, you go to chapel, right? And then of course, since you're at archery range, look what else you can find. You can also find monk's robes. And right next door to that, which is hotel, you can find cloth. And now it does become a little more awkward to find everything you need, but it's not impossible. The main important thing here with Sylvia is to realize you are incredibly efficient at just going in, grabbing what you need and leaving. You do not need to stay anywhere for long and you're incredibly tanky with this build. So you're going to disengage incredibly fast, right? So if somebody tries to jump on you, say a Jackie, you could just E, W, ulti and just zoom away. Make sure, and again, I really cannot stress this enough. Please make sure that you are topped off on fuel at all times. If you are not, not even like say topped off, at least like halfway, you're going to have some issues. That is your main way of disengage and that's going to be a thing that keeps you safe and make you such an annoying character to deal with. After a few games of this character, you will learn her potential quite well and I think Think you'll probably see the same thing i did and where you're like wait maybe this character actually isn't the worst thing ever she's actually pretty solid i'm not here to say this character is amazing or anything but i do think with people that are competent on her that she is a character that could do quite well and honestly i'm very excited to see what people come up with her because i don't even think this is the final iteration of what we're going to see of her i think this character could still be improved upon and there are people like we said like earlier like superstar jenny pm howard uh impulse just really good players who are just slamming this character down and just doing a really good job of her but yeah that's gonna be all for me today guys if you do enjoy the video and you like this incredibly long-winded explanation feel free to leave a like down below uh feel free to leave a comment on what you want to see next and you know usual shameless plug we do have a discord and i would like for you know anyone here to who's watching this to join discord we have a great community going on over there and of course we stream live every day at 4 p.m est over at twitch.tv forward slash tom sorcerer you can follow us there and lastly and i probably won't be shouting out this one very much i'm just gonna do it and it's once that we just started is uh we actually started a patreon the patreon is going to it only has one tier it's one dollar for anybody who wants to back it the main goal of it uh long term is hopefully to actually have enough funding in it to be able to hire an editor because <laughs> uh this is kind of painful not gonna lie making videos is kind of hard but um it, it the only perks i can really give anybody right now with it since it's only a one dollar tier and i honestly have nothing else to give since everything we make is free the youtube and the you know streaming is the same perks i give subscribers so if you do end up backing the page Patreon and you join the discord i can give you guys a special role and that role will give you the same role as subscribers so you'll be able to see the subs only rooms and you'll be able to see or have priority in community events such as custom games sub tourneys stuff like that but yeah that's gonna be all for me today guys i hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay video again uh, sorry for the incredibly long explanation we'll try to keep it a little more condensed next time but this character has a lot going on for her and i will see you all next time appreciate it new bro terrible you're running a terrible build. Don't run you down. T just leave my chickens out of this and we can talk. All right, chickens right here, right? Am I gonna look like an idiot in two seconds? I'm gonna look like a fucking idiot in two seconds, aren't I? I'm ready. Oh, that hit. Okay, I'm nuts. No, why am I so bad? Hey, hey, yo. hey, chill, 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 chill. Wait. You suck. <laughs> You're fucking mad. Get the boy. Get out of here. Get out of here. You're mad, Nana. Is this what we're doing? Really? Oh shit. Did you even make food? No, please. 
actually died to this. He's mad? Yeah, I would run at you too. Yeah, I would run at me too. I don't fucking blame that. I, don't, I do the exact same shit. Yo, why is Gizzy in here? Yo, everybody's sniping. Hey, no, 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 no. Alright, y'all got flown there. I'm out. That guy's guy, yeah, he has his one inch punch. I'm good. You fucking hear him, dude? Alright, but you didn't go for the Yuki. Alright, bro. Alright, Gizzy. You playing like a true fan, bro. I see you, man. I see you, brother. Hey, your ass over there. You smell. No fights? You kind of can't kill things on this character until level 6. Also, why did I just make the disinfectant? Why did I just eat it? Look at all that teaming, Sag. Yeah, bro. It's... The name is the name of Tim Wizard's too powerful. The boy genius. He's gonna just see. Right, I was ready. I was ready for it, dude. I was ready for the toxicity. You better win. You died for the meme. Wait, you're dead already. Oh, quit box. Thank you. Look, today I won't flame a little backsy. Okay, I'm fucking dead, man. Am I taking requests today? Yeah, the requests are open, man. You killed yourself? Eating disinfectant? Ah, oh, come on, you never been a kid before? You never just had a little disinfectant in your diet? Don't be ridiculous. You think you're so special, huh? I killed myself because I felt bad. Why would you feel bad? Ah, cool. So... Do you just start farming up a storm here? So how are you using fuel? Are you are you just saving fuel and finish your build or am I just like killing mobs with uh with bike? Why no chalky milk? We don't need chalky milk. Alright, so we make our go, we got our shit, we're happy lads. Use from mobs with QE. There go. Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, let me not for me, thank you. Hello? Dude, my friend, you are... ...not very strong. It was the sound, the chunk, the fucking chunk it made. It made the saddest sound. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it was such a sad sound. Oh fuck, I suck. Hey, yo, rip ace up. Did he just get Howarded? Dude, I think he did. Nah, this is my game. Good luck, have fun. Oh, I missed the file. I apologize. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, shit. I'm low as fuck. Hey, what are you on, buddy? Oh, yeah. I'm staying away from you. I'm good. We can talk later. And by later, I mean never. Tom, the pleading sanity makes him laugh. You guys ever play Don't Starve? That's me right now. Fight him. That's a great idea. What if I just simply don't do that? I don't want potatoes, but I kind of want my build. Hello, friends. Hey, what's up, Tapanelli? How are you? Can you post a clip? It's gonna time you out if you try posting a clip. Sim wants to know if you be our third, dude. I don't want to grief swim right now. I think I'm gonna. Call I think I'm good for now. Tell him I love him though. <laughs> I would. He would be so hard griefed. I literally would- he would just get annoyed by how, like, dumb I would be playing right now. Ah, it's crazy, on uh, This reveal season, though. Except the Squibus so we could Q-Snipe, please? Nah, man. I'll play with him after the stream or something. Well, I don't think I'm gonna be awake. I 
Oh, nice. Let's do it. We did it, chat. Does guy give tips on how to play this game? Well, if you ask, I will give you tips. How's that sound, Will? If you ask, I'll give you tips. That's not like a fair trade. Would you be would you be satisfied to that? How to win? Get first place. Now, if you want a more like not vague answer, you you can try that. Kill people in school now. Was there noise? Oh yeah, there is noise. You're right. Let's fuck people up. Yeah, impulse with my eyes right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you for giving this game so much fun. Hey, that's awesome, dude. Wait one second. Where are you going? Why are you on that? Wait, hello? Why are you fast? Um, actually, now that I think about this, I don't want to do that. That's nah, sad. Yeah, I'm good. I thought about biking into her, but yeah, that was a good. So I don't know if you're trying to have some fun, if you know what I mean. Nah, not right now. Not right now. I'm way too tired. I'm just going to grief the poor man. Uh, what's the easiest character to play? Jackie or Aya are, are going to be my recognition. They're the tutorial characters for a reason. And they're very strong, both of them. They're going to teach you how to play a ranged character very easily and play on how to play a melee character very easily. They're both very strong. They both take a little bit of time to master. And you can take them quite far. Highly recommend both of them. Very simple kits. Any chance we get to see the here gameplay? Uh, if anyone redeems the here gameplay, we will do the here gameplay. I will try my best to uh, give good gameplay, but um, I can't guarantee anything today. I apologize. All right, what am I missing right now? I need to make this like fucking line here. So just CP Hotel, honestly. I mean, this whiskey. We can't redeem just saying out of stock. Alright, mods, you have one job. Hey, yo, is that the boy Gizzy? Yo, remember Pond, bro? Yo, I remember Pond. What's good? Yeah, remember Pond? Oh, that hit? You hate to see it, bro! No, 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 no. Do you remember Pawn? It's over for you. How do you feel about using Brazil gauntlets? Oh, God. I feel slightly indifferent, but fuck it. Sylvia S tier? Pug? Yeah, it's character nuts. Next, next question. How do you not rent a problem having inventory full and can't build anything? So that's just poor inventory management. What you need to do is, uh, you, your probably things you're holding on to that you shouldn't be. So, like, for example, you know how you have, like, that bread and water early on? You should probably not be holding on to that for the entire time. Like, either make it to a more food or realize you probably have recipes in your inventory that you're not crafting yet. Learn the recipe so you can make combinations. You're not holding on to things for so long. Okay, so what am I on here? Ah shit! I need to be. I need to be the the, the fast. All right, one second. One second, chat. Why are you here? All right, I'll be real with you. I actually just do not want to deal with you right now. You smell, and I am not in the mood for you. This kind of sucks, though. Ah, uh, dude, everywhere I need to go is closing. I should have been paying attention to this earlier. Um, it's not the end of the world though. I'll just do this and we could just walk in real quick Wait, did I miss one? What am I missing? Oh, I missed four. Ah, that's fine though. That's not a big deal That's not a big deal. I should have beat those rules by the way how important are passive? 15% amp is huge. 15% is quite the number. I should be topping off on, um, what's it called? On fuel, by the way. My bad. 
Regen Magnus, should you play it? No. The Regen Magnus build is literally reserved for the biggest chat on the planet. Hey, yo, rip to the boy. HL3. Oh, no, dude. All right, CC. And someone redeemed the game of it. Streamer gets final decision, by the way. Smile. He did. Well, he did the test things. I don't. I don't. Hey, what's going on here? No, 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 no! Come back! What's wrong? Why are you a bitch now? You're a wimp. Pathetic. To test, you misunderstand. I don't know what you're talking about. He's running because of time? Pathetic. I don't care. I'm a little Sylvia. I'm just minding my business. And you're gonna run? Toxic streamer? I'm on zero sleep. This is a toxic stream. You're right. This is true gaming mode right now. This is where we just start flaming everyone. What am I missing again? I was missing forest. There's an orange box right there. And it looks real juicy. Also, there's noise, and I kind of just want to mess up that Kiara. That toxic? It's a little toxic, but... Hey, it's my favorite gender-neutral streamer. What? Hey, buddy. Remember me? Why did I throw it like that? Why am I bad at this game? Boop. Uh, let's see how this works. Because I'll be real. I feel like. Ah, uh, whoops. I messed that up. Give me a second here. Give me a second here, chat. Wait, give me a fucking second here. Stop auto attacking for like two seconds. Kind of tired of you already. Alright, we should have won that, but I'm really bad at this game. Alright. Caverwan Shoichi picked the rest of the items. Man, you're honestly about to be the first person. I am Tom's number one today. Yo, Tapanel is actually the only, like, non toxic person to me. What a blessing, my god. Oh god, it's round two. And you try to kill me and I don't appreciate Yes, I have to kill you. I'm sorry. Why are you still here? Why? Why, Halbron? Are you gonna ulti me again? Is this what's happening? Oh, ni nice. Nice you. Alright, nice Q. Why did I do no damage to you? Come back here. Alright, I'm gonna leave now. I don't appreciate you killing time and do anything wrong. Hey man, don't do Guys do Kai press star. Nice job, Bitify. I'm sorry. As a number two, I say no because he was toxic and we should enjoy the show. I want friends too, Neo. Why can't I have friends? Why is there gonna be toxic to me? I didn't do anything. Subs over friendship. Come on, Sinner. Just wait till rivals. We'll see what friendship is. Um, okay, my brain is fried right now. Where the hell am I going? I have potatoes. Just give me a rock. God. Tom, I do it for money, sorcerer. Yeah, that makes so much money, by the way. <laughs> Who maxes passiveness? He texts me. He's actually really nice. Um, I think I do agree with not maxing passive because of how the character works with two abilities. I'd rather just have stronger abilities. Provides a good entertainment. Hey, you love to see it. Wait, we're actually top three right now. Let's just mess people up. All right, we should probably be farming. Like, let's be real here. I don't like it. I did win for getting leather early is an issue. Just steal leather off Nana. It's not that complicated. Look, you see Nana down here? Just steal leather off them as well. Also, where the hell? 
Is Jackie passive skillable? No, Jackie passive is very important. Pretty much any build. Jackie passive do be quite good. All right, rest in pieces. I'm going to be quite honest with you, friend. Just make make that build in your client and then just send it to me on my Discord and I'll play. How about that, man? That's not fair. Guys, I'll be real with you. My brain cells are in its like, last... They're trying their best to survive right now. Sure. Ah, right, cool. Why didn't I grab cams earlier? What am I doing? It's Crit Shoichi just tonight. You think I can't win a Crit Shoichi? You didn't name a character. Got a point. I've been doing UB games with Shoichi. Oh. Oh my god, that guy is a fucking unit. Oh, this game is actually just over. Wait. Well, this was a fun game, guys. Yo. Second place gamer, by the way. Hey, white flag? No? Hey, sir, come back over here. Sir, I need you to be my friend. You got this, Tim? Sir, I know you're in here. Can you just... Alright, man, whatever. Tom, when are we right? Three S tiers dueling. Yeah, it's just three S tiers looking at each other. Three beautiful lads just looking at each other. All right, so we're just going to do that thing where we third party. I'm a big fan of that thing. Maybe they'll just be like a real smart fight. Please fight. <laughs> Please fight. I'm crying. Please. Just fight each other, man. But they both want a third party of you? I know, I have a gun, so suddenly I'm the threat when I shouldn't be. <laughs> Please, man. Come on, are we white flagging? Are we homies? You don't seem like a homie, I'll be real with you. You seem like the opposite of what a homie would be. Alright, so why white flag you now? Are we homies? No? Okay. Check my build when game ends? Got you, man. Come on, bro. This guy. I'm rooting for Chef. That's toxic as hell. What the fuck? Um, great. They're not gonna fight right off the bat. I know that for an absolute fact, so this is about to be real fun. Oh! I'm on my business. Hey, man. I need you over there. Over there. Yes. Oh my god, the camera is bugging out so bad. No, 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 no. You go on her. Stop! He's trying to get into threat range. He's trying to press a single button. Dude, I'm fine with this. You don't want a white flag, man. This is all up to you. You know? Away. Wait, I need a Juka done now. Oh my god. Wait, I got more timer. Wait? Chat? This character actually is S tier. Wait. Wait. Chat. 